midnight in Gotham City, the very dead of night. The Green Hornet and Cato outside the Pink Ship Stamp Factory. Something must be very much amiss inside the Pink Ship Stamp Factory for them to invade Batman's territory a long way from home indeed. And for a come out! Why leave? We had them reeling. We saw enough, Cato. I think at last we found what we've been looking for. Tomorrow night we'll wrap everything up. Then in the rosy fingered morn. Guess you can't win them all, Mr. Reed. Ever since Bruce Wayne and I were kids, we've been rivals in one way or another. The rumor is out the Green Hornet is in our fair city for a piece of the action. A piece of the action at the Pink Chip Stamp Factory. That seems strange. With his heinous reputation for high stakes, a cut of a trading stamps factory would seem like... The quack? And undoubtedly knowing something about the missing Gotham Gothic. And I have a feeling that Batman and Robin are going to be on our tails tonight, making our task that much more tricky. How so? Well, to the world at large, they're known as the Caped Crusaders, fearless crime fighters. Whereas, due to the nature of our operation, the same world at large looks on us as criminals. Only a very few know different. <laughs> sure does sound tricky. So I'll turn my hornet's ding to half maximum power. I don't want to get careless and hurt Batman if we clash. Well, you always have your gas gun. Right. And nothing must stop us from gaining our ends. So, to the battlefield. Because the Green Hornet and Cato are still alive inside this machine. Governor, his goons are getting away. No, Robin, they've had it and they know it. They won't get far. Holy living end. It looked like the end there for a minute, do I wonder? But there was a small niche between the gum applier and the perforating needles. And we are both quite flexible. But there wasn't enough room to use my hornet sting to blast us out until that panel was loosened. But how did the machine take your picture? No doubt an automatic image orthicon of some kind. Wrong, Green Hornet. It was a high-velocity spectroscopic range reflector mini unit. But how could you know they were alive in there, Batman? When this masked meddler was tossed into that machine, he had this gruesome gizmo with him. But you will notice, Robin, it is conspicuously missing from that giant stamp. Your mini unit failed to produce a true facsimile. Gosh, that's some ergo, Batman. You seem thoughtful. We're heading for another clash with the caped crusaders, and I don't like it. Why not? We've never run away from trouble before. Yes, but this double identity poses extra problems this time. We know they're heroic crime fighters. They think we're criminals. We must come out on top, but they mustn't suffer. Kung Fu is Kung Fu. It's not child's play. I know, but our tricks are gonna have to be tempered with good judgment. There's gum in that phony disguise. Let's make our move. <laughs> Even though they don't know it. It's a good thing those guys aren't in town every week. Here, a Mexican standoff, a dead heat, a photo finish. Batman can handle this. Let's go. 
In the classic tradition of the Fish Out of Water story, TV Land presents the Hillbilly Out of Squalor story. Stay tuned for the Beverly Hillbillies next on TV Land.